All right, let's check out what classmates have to say. Elliot gave me nothing. <laughs> so all Maki's is, Maki's, Machias does is study. <laughs> I have to agree. I hate when shit is messy in my uh miles too. Why is he just staring at the wall? What? <laughs> I feel like I probably should have did the uh should have showed uh didn't not saved and showed you the other scene where you go to uh Emma's room and you can hear her talking to somebody and then the cat's there so yeah <laughs> That's my fault. I apologize for that. The hell? Oh God, she sighed. <laughs> Why don't you go get in the bed? <laughs> oh, that's a... Uh... Look at Sarah. <laughs> Look at the booze, man. <laughs> Big ass bottles of just beer and everything else. She even got shit over here. Like, Jesus Christ. Look, empty bottles right there. More sh beer over here. Like, bro, all she get is plastered like all day long. Yeah, but I hope everybody's doing great. Uh, okay. What the hell is he doing? What is she sitting on? Weapons and explosives. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Want to sleep together? What? She really asked it. Want to sleep together? Oh wow. Uh <laughs> and I was like I uh got to go. Yeah. That's the that's the correct answer there. I, you know, that's it's not great. A fee is like what, 14, 15? That's just oh yeah, it's Laura's room.
<laughs> that's the reason why you do this because you kind of get a feel for their personalities I think the only other person we need to talk to is Sharon, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe Sarah's down here too. Yeah, there's Sarah. I'm back! Oh, wow. I, I never I never understood like the whole like drinking thing. I know some people like to get you know fucked up and you know all that stuff like that and like to party and stuff, but I never understood like what do you get out of just getting completely shit faced? Like I, I don't I don't I don't understand it. Like I I've drunk you know, I've drunk before and you know, I try to keep it, you know, chill I guess I'll say it's not like but I can I can go out perfectly and not have a drink either and be totally fine and just it's not something I just need to do or makes me feel like I'm a man in some type of way or something or make me feel powerful like some people feel like yeah you don't, you ain't drinking it you ain't an adult or some shit like that and I think that's absolutely ridiculous some people just don't like I don't know I don't find the funny i've drunk hard shit i've drunk light shit i've drunk all of it it's just i mean it's cool i understand you know like yeah give me a drink you know but i don't understand the appeal and getting where you fall all over the place and all that shit like that and somebody like get his keys you know if it gets that bad it's like bro come on all right we'll go in for the night i just don't understand it i mean maybe maybe somebody can <laughs> Explain it to me in the comments or something. I don't know. I just don't see the appeal of it. We only got one. We need to just go to the old schoolhouse today. And I'm not trying to diss people that do drink, so please don't don't think I'm trying to do that. I just I, I if you drink, that's and that's what you like, that's what you do, okay. But I'm talking about like when what is the appeal and when you just fall all over yourself and it's like eh, blah, blah, and all that shit. Um, let me see here. Got hers. So I think I did. Emma, it's three bonding events today. And I'm trying to think of who to do. Because I think I did Elisa and Emma. But I got all the class seven, so okay. So you know, like days like today, you go to um, you go get new books and all this stuff like that. 
trying to get your heads up. I know you talk to you could talk to the lady that's in the gardening department today. I remember that. Uh, who else? Who else? Who else? Who else? Toa. Oh, so I did get all the toas. Okay, so now I got all the toas, so I don't have to talk to toas. So who's left? Lindy and Vivi. Vivi, I mean, I'm talking about Vivi. I think they so they're the last ones. And Sarah. Apparently. Hmm. So we'll do Sarah and well, I don't think you get a chance to talk to the Linden of Vivi yet. Well, we got three bonding events to do. So I think Celine, we have to feed the cat. I think she's here on the second floor somewhere. There she is. Zerum, like she, I told you, she gives she gives you these zerum powders and stuff like that, and and uh, they're just really good items. And I don't really know what the end game of, of this game is gonna be on Nightmare, like, cause it looks like the the monsters are all getting stronger. Here is Linda and Vivi. I don't know why you keep calling the girl Vivi. I think it's you trying to match the other girl name, but Lindy, Linde, and Vivi. Okay, so yeah, that's not they're not getting character notes for them, so I'm guessing it's gonna be something else I gotta do. That gets their other note. Um but we will go. I think Sarah's down here with Mitt. Where the hell is Sarah? She's just over here? Huh. Yeah, we're gonna follow after. surprised that she didn't notice Reen following her. She's very, on mostly on the other game, she, she's very keen to what's going on, usually. They could have showed the fight. If you hadn't uh, noticed, but uh, Instructor Sarah's a bit of a badass, yeah, you kind of find that out on the second one, too. I'll admit how cool and awesome she is. She is. If it wasn't for the fact that she was plastered <laughs> most of the times. Teacher and student, it'll never work out. What's that tragic? How will I ever cope? That's hilarious. Right. 
Right. He let you get in a free lesson. Look at how that sounded. <laughs> Boy, I was like, look, I am not trying to hit on you. Even though you actually can. You can, you can, um, you can't hit on her. I wouldn't mind see how a romance will play out between her and him. Like, I think by the time the fourth game comes, she's like about 27 and he's like 22, I think. Not that far apart. Yeah, it looks kind of weird now. But, you know. Uh, so let's see. I know I did Elisa and Emma. I'll do Elisa again because that's, you know, that's who I'm romancing. So, just showing you how her romance kind of actually worked out. I'll pick somebody different in Emma's place. I'll probably do like Gaius or something. Sharon, Sharon definitely kind of, you can tell Sharon ships them as a couple. Sharon is like, yeah, kind of love this. I look like I had a grandpa to wear. <laughs> mm, what would they need a long time for? Look at a blushing. Gaius, Machius, Emma. I think I think Emma's the one I did last time. Um, I think Fee. I think hers is she's like in the infirmary, if I'm not mistaken, and she's like getting a nap. Yeah, see, she's sleeping. See what uh, Gaius's looks like. Oh, he's in a dorm. There he is.
Yeah, I'll do Gaius. Gaius has become one of my favorite characters in the game. I know there's people that don't like him, but I mean, it is what it is. He's a... Uh, I like his demeanor and what he stands for. And he's he's been probably in my playthroughs, he's been like one of just the most mature and clutch characters I've had in my in my you know, in my playthroughs. I know some people play with other people. You know, he likes to draw, so that might not be all that exciting. You know, it might be boring to some people, but... I don't know. I just... I don't know. Dude's cool to me. Elliot, too. I think I, I think Elliot's like... I like Elliot's character. He's cool. But I just, I just feel like Elliot don't belong in the... Uh, when they're fighting he hates he doesn't even like to fight or anything so it's like all he talked about is music i'd be like dude if he was just the, the cool friend that you saw but he did music and was never in the group he'd be a decent character i felt but like i think this game was the only one that i like really liked his moves on here because he had this defense move that it gives you defense and it gives you hp back and it's like about broken. It's broken as hell on this game, honestly. If, especially if you are uh, when you're building them up. But I don't know if he has it in part two. I think I just rarely used him in part two and um, three. Like talking about it. He's a strong magic user in his own right. It's just, I don't know. There are just other interesting characters that come along that kind of outshine him. Even Gaius gets more, a lot more interesting in terms of his thing. Because at first, he's kind of like this tanky character. Like, he hits hard, but no good magic power. But then later on, you know, he kind of becomes, in his own right, just about as powerful as Laura. Yeah, but it, it really don't matter who I spend time with. Shit, they all they all level up to the highest in damn way. Uh, let's see. We are not going to do. We are in chapter four. Yeah, these are optional. I just really don't think I'm going to waste time doing them. I actually think, wait a minute. Damn. Okay, yeah, this one. Let me see. I think it's a, um,. the one where you have to fight one of the uh yeah yeah f uh friddle and uh Al and logins okay so you talk to bridget if i'm not mistaken i think she's in the dorms one of the, is it a lower class? It might be upper class. Tripping. Yeah, it's up here. Where is she at? Right there. Oh, okay. Yeah, we're not going to do that one. I'm tripping. So, basically, that quest is a, um... It's a, it's a battle between, uh... Alan and, uh... Yeah. The resolve he had, uh... 
the reason he avoided Bridget was that he didn't want her to see him as his le- less than his best because Alan like likes her and uh, that's all that quest really was it was um yeah I had to, I had to remember it sorry about that now there is a hidden quest here but you have to finish that quest in order to get the hidden quest and what happens is uh, Major Nightheart calls you and when he calls you he uh he basically says to you uh oh okay it's a scene right here oh Patrick <laughs> oh my god Trying to feign nothing. <laughs> this dude's right here is ridiculous. Nope, that's just how Rain is. You can tell his pride was like super hurt. All right, yeah. So, uh, like I was saying, that um, Major Nightheart's is on a, that hidden quest, and he basically challenged you to swimming. He brings all the boys in. It's like I heard you guys were ch- you know swimming and this, this, and that, and and then you have to go against him and swimming. And if you beat him, I think you get like it's like yeah, like the quest. I think it's like four AP, and you get the extra AP if you like win, and you get link points added with all the the boys that you uh you call. Um, that's really it that happens there. It's a, not really integral to the plot. That's why I didn't do the whole quest. I'm trying to mainly do plot stuff and uh, the actual required quest. Uh, who am I bringing this time? Uh, Useless and Machias. I need to get their levels up. I don't really know if they're going to level up, though. Um, I guess everybody that's underpowered. Yeah. And it's very interesting, depending on who you bring, the dialogue is a little different. These are people who I really didn't play with a lot in my um, my first playthrough. Because I played with Laura, Emma, and uh, another particular person a whole lot near the end game. Don't want to spoil it, but... Yeah, that's really it. Oh, and also right there, you can't put Laura and Fee on the team at the same time. <laughs> I found that out because they just they ain't they ain't fuck with each other like that. <laughs> Oh shit, that means I'm- oh god.
Uh, I'm gonna see if I can beat them without using quartz. Cause I think this is just uh, the thing that we're about to face is a. Uh, I think it's great, good against magic defense. Let's be careful, everyone. All right. Somebody needs to wear detection. Who else has it? No. Try to make this as quick as possible. We're only gonna fight the fight that we have to fight. Damn, I can't believe like a nice spot. Killed that big one. Damn. Shock me. Uh, yeah, up here. I have to get the treasure chest for those that don't know. Oh, a treasure chest. Still trying to get that damn trophy. Day two. Oh, uh, very well. Leave it to me. Oh. No? Who else can do this? Uh, I don't think I bought anybody that can break this. Son of a bitch. Oh, that is stinky. <laughs> yeah, I don't think. Um, I'll handle this. Right. No. God damn it. I gotta get the chest up there. I literally have to go back. Yeah. And have to get somebody like, I think Laura is the only person I have that can break them. Boy, that is, uh, shit. That sucks. Well. <laughs> shit. Oh my god, that is... Alright, let me, uh... Okay. See... Yeah, Elliot can be out. We don't need Mr. Elliot. No diss to Elliot, but you know, we don't need him. Um... That'll work. Well, that was a. Uh... Damn it. <laughs> Complete waste of damn time. So you have to bring Laura here. She's the only one that can break those uh those blocks. All right, let's get started. Maybe that's why they uh like I don't know. That's crazy. I right, think about it though. <laughs> Can do this, of course. No, I got those. Yeah, they did that one. That shit, even with her, it takes three uh three to do it. My turn. That's I've how badass Lor is. <laughs> had to go get it just to break some fucking blocks. <laughs> How fucking ridiculous is that? You know, oh, you know what? I think Machias can do it done. too. Oh, pain. I think Machias can do it too. I'm tripping. I think Machias can break those blocks with his... Uh, I think he just got to shoot it uh, a bunch of times. Ah, shit. That's on me not having the patience. Uh... How the fuck do I get up there? 
Okay, something up here. change the floors let me that's gonna bring that part down yeah this is gonna move oh, treasure chest I don't know what treasure chest I missed during my playthrough I thought I got everything is that a treasure chest wait where oh there okay yeah I see it But apparently I missed something somewhere. If you're trying to like get the trophies and everything, just make sure you have um the detection quartz. That way when you go through the stages you can see where everything is, the treasure chest and all that. These things can get a little, you know, twisting and turny. You kind of looking like the hell's going on. All right, we gotta fight this one. Enemy sighted. Take him out. My turn. As your planes, yeah. Y'all seen it enough. Uh. Give it to us, rush. Fuck. I'll handle this. I mean, burst. Now, there we go. finish this together. Of course. Leave it to me. I didn't do that enough either during my uh, playthrough, and I think you gotta do it like a hundred times. <laughs> there could have been no other outcome. Evergreen is a nice, uh, it's a nice item. It's one of the um, better ones in the game to me. Well, no, I actually think it's up there. When it comes to top tier uh, accessories that you will probably want. Um, I think that's it. There's the end. Oh shit. I, mean, I shouldn't have done it. <laughs> I'm tripping. These things are getting a little tougher though, so I will save here just in case. Just in case. I think this I could be strong enough to hurt it but these things this thing's defense is like pretty killer but I, I think the s craft still hurt it though a worthy adversary my turn uh, this is my secret weapon Target all energy Let's make Here we go. 
did all right damage to it. But see, I'm going to give you an example. See what I'm talking about? It only did 220-something. Well. And I've been one-shotting most of these people. That's how, like, yeah. <laughs> and he has, like, no arcs off this thing. Oh, that's right. I got him on a road to. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so we'll probably be using Alisa a lot for this fight. My turn. Even Rain doesn't have any uh doesn't have any um magic. Burn the ass. Ha! Right. Oh, I wish I could get them all in that. That's big critical, too. That should kill the middle one. No, I got the other one almost, too. Cool, that works. Gotta watch out, because the other two are, um, confused. <laughs> the defense on that thing. Right. Uh, he has no arts either. <laughs> I'm <am> unprepared. <laughs> uh, let's see. Gotta have an item or something on here. Yeah, I'll definitely give it to her probably. Thanks. It's my turn. So she can actually. Do some damage to these damn things. I can't, I can't believe he's only taking off 111. Yeah, so that thing's defense is absolutely fucking ridiculous. Yeah. You is hitting pretty fucking hard. Uh. Oh, he woke up out of it now. Oh huh? shit! I did not mean to get it to him. I suppose I should thank you. Of course. I suppose I should thank you. I actually had to heal up in this boss fight, so you know it's pretty fucking ridiculous. Thanks. Here we go. Alright, uh we'll delay him. Is it gonna delay him though? Oh, it killed him. Okay. <laughs> yeah, but just so you know about that fight, those uh That's the power of the eight leaves. And the only reason why I put quartz on everybody is because I just, it, it's irritating when you, get, when you go on a field study. It takes the, uh, all the stuff off of everybody anyway. And you go through all that trying to like get everybody set up right only for them to take all the other extra quartz and stuff you use on people off. And it just, it's, it's, it's irritating. So it's like, fuck it. And like right now we're really strong. So I'm trying to get as far as I can in the game without having to do that. At least that they done doing field studies.
Alright. So they heard something move. What happened here? Now, if you bring Emma here when this happens, uh, it's, a, it's a different, it's some different dialogue. There's a reason why, but you have to watch it to uh, find that out. <laughs> It all begins to make sense as it goes along. Let me see something. I wonder if I change and see. Uh, and, uh, and uses feet. Let me see if it'll do something, change if I take Emma down there after the whole thing is over. With. Probably won't since I did the whole. Nah. Nah. Okay. But now that she's in the group, that's the dialogue will probably be a little different. If you hadn't figured it out, like she is in her own way connected to this whole thing. And you find out. I'm surprised she didn't say nothing right there. Ah, uh, one extra point. Uh, I know there's another hidden quest. Here as well. Um, I think it's with the principal too. Yeah, and I think I already got it. Where you find out he enjoyed calligraphy. So, 
thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Who are you bonding events with? Laura and Elliot. Who did I do? Let me see. I think maybe I probably did Laura because I've been rocking with her for a while. She's swimming again. Yeah, there's Monica. Or was this when she was training in the room? Yeah, this is a... Uh... Hmm. I don't remember who I did. I really don't. See, Ellie is over here. Yeah, they, 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 they go, uh, they go Vincent got caught up by Margarita. Like, uh oh. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I may have done I may have done Elias now I think about it. Cause I think up at that time he had I hadn't spent a lot of time with him neither. I kind of am not. <laughs> you know what? Fuck it. We'll do lore. I don't remember if I did her or not. I think I may have. I don't know. Shit. I, I'm trying to remember some of this stuff as it, go, as it goes along, but it's tough. I feel like hers would be a little bit more interesting than what Elliot got going on. I literally stood in front of your face. She's all right. You know, I'm glad I did it this way because her and Fee thing, it's a, it's a, it's actually a part of the story in a way because them two had a little, this little uh, thing going on here. You know what's crazy? I'm actually on a part on part four where they they bring this up that they were not getting along. May Lord happy.
Laura's hiding her own way. She is. Now, if you're definitely going for that uh, whole, that girl that's like tough as hell and shit, do just as much as Ring can, yeah. Look at this asshole sitting by himself. Lonely ass. <laughs> Get your lonely ass up. I thought I saw Kenneth's ass over here. Where the hell is Kenneth? I think there's a scene too when you try to leave here. Let's get that scene. Yeah. I think there is. You know what? No, no, no. I forgot something. Celine is on the roof. I remember it right. She is. I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, nope. There it is. See the little tail. See? I'm, I'm, I remember some stuff. Any chance you see her, you want to give her that fresh milk. So. Probably need to buy some more. Them serum powders and stuff just make life so much easier. Especially when you're playing on a nightmare mode. That's the only reason why I'm doing it. Um... What else? Uh, I think everything is. Yeah, I think I got everybody's. I don't think there's anybody else to talk to. I got to figure out what it. That Lindy and Vive thing. VV, I'm sorry. I keep saying that shit. Goddamn. Um. Okay. this damn thing. Uh, yeah. Alright, well, I'm going to stop here. Before I go to the next video, I want to say thank you to everybody that's checking me out. If you're liking the videos, make sure you Please like and subscribe. I'm trying to build the channel up. Um, I think I'm about to 50 subscribers so far. So, hey, somebody liking something. <laughs> uh, you can drop comments. I, I respond to all comments. You want to talk about the games? I'm, I, I don't care. I love talking about games. I don't, I don't, it doesn't matter. But um, what else? I have some other stuff coming up. I just started Nio. I'm, I'm going to do... Right. I keep saying I'm going to do the Tomb Raider. I am going to do it. I'm going to get into the Tomb Raider trilogy. Um, Avengers. I'm trying to think what the next RPG is going to be. Besides these trails. Now. I'm trying to really knock all the trails out. As fast as I can. Because um, 4 just seems like it's going to be a really long game. And uh, I'm actually doing a full walkthrough on that. So I know it's going to take a lot longer than me doing these kind of story playthroughs. Um, but thank you guys as always. Thank you for rocking with me. Um, I will see you guys in the next vid. Peace.